Let's write the net ionic equation for HNO2 plus BaOH2. This is nitrous acid and this is barium hydroxide. So this is a neutralization reaction. We have an acid here with the HNO2, BaOH2, that's a base. This is a strong base. So neutralization reaction, we get a salt and water. To write the net ionic equation, first we have to balance the molecular equation. That'll look like this. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Now we need to write the states for each substance, and that looks like this. So HNO3, nitrous acid, is a weak acid. It'll dissolve in water, but it's a weak acid, a weak electrolyte, so we need to keep that in mind. Barium hydroxide, that's a strong base, so it's going to be aqueous. It'll dissociate into its ions. Barium nitrite, that's soluble, and then water, that's a liquid. So once we have these states, we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. And we only split the strong electrolytes. So that'll look like this. So because HNO2 is a weak acid, we don't split that apart in net ionic equations. It only dissociates a little bit. Most of the time, it's HNO2. We don't split that apart, and we don't split liquids apart in net ionic equations either. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out those spectator ions. They're on both sides. I see on the top, the reactants, I have the barium ion. On the bottom, products, I also have the barium ion. That's a spectator ion. We're going to cross that out. Everything else, though, is unique. So this is the net ionic equation for HNO2 plus BaOH2. Let me clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is our balanced net ionic equation for nitrous acid plus barium hydroxide. You'll note that we have a 2 in front of everything. Since we have the same coefficient in front of everything, we can reduce that down to 1, and we don't write the 1 by convention. You'll also note that charge is conserved. In the reactants, we have a 1 minus, and in the products, we have a 1 minus. So charge is the same, and if you count up the atoms, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for nitrous acid plus barium hydroxide. Thanks for watching.